Hey Scorpio, this is Nick. I hope that everybody is doing well, you guys. Please forgive me for being absent for the last, well, few days. Um, at, I'm changing some things up, you guys. At the end of the um, month, I'm going to be doing a lot more prayer and a lot more meditation. I'm getting into my downloads, okay? So uh, you may see me getting missing in action for three, four days, something like that. But I will be back, okay? Excuse my voice, you guys. I've been talking for a long time. Also... Um, I want to come bring you this energy, Scorpio. I accidentally skipped over you guys yesterday, so I'm doing two for y'all today. I had some people in the comments like, is Scorpio that bad? I'm like, hell, not my Scorpio not that bad. <laughs> Shit, I just accidentally got dang on deleted their video. Y'all know I love y'all. All right, so um, what we have here is I got some side notes, but we're going to get into the overall energy first. Overall energy is nine of swords, okay? This is depression. This is um, anxiety. This is, um, you know, despair. Maybe somebody is not talking, okay? Um, maybe y'all call, like, calling each other names or whatever the case may be. But at the same time, if somebody is not blocked, if somebody is not left on red, which some of you guys are, um, look, or vice versa, okay, cross watcher energy, cross watchers. If you want to hang out and chill, watch Scorpio. I have no problem with that. I love cross watchers. So like, share, and subscribe. And um, I do eight other signs plus men's tarot. You might find yourself there, okay? Um, and then you got hangman here, okay? Something is in limbo. Something is stagnant. Something is at a standstill, okay? Um, up underneath this nine of swords, I got Wheel of Fortune, y'all. Somebody here who is relieving, rel reliving some type of past trauma. Things keep playing over and over in their mind. Feels to me like somebody wants this to go away. Somebody wants this to, you know, go in a better direction, okay? Whatever they're depressed about, whatever they're sad about, you know, whatever is really messing with their mental, you know, they want this shit to stop. They, it's almost like I'm sitting here going through, and when is this shit going to stop, okay? I'm hurting, I'm in pain, I want to talk to somebody, but I'm getting this feeling like somebody doesn't even want to be in that energy. Like, when will I not give a fuck no more? You see what I'm saying? It's that type of energy. Hey, man. Hangman is clarified by the lovers, okay? So this situation has everything to do with a lover situation, got everything to do with a bond. It got everything to do with um, somebody feeling like they're a soulmate connection. This is unity. Um, this definitely is a very strong chemistry. This is um, somebody who loves to be with one another. However, like I said, a lover's card, that's a choice card, y'all. And um, y'all that's new to my channel, Y'all know that it's, rec you know, I always say it represents Adam and Eve, okay, the, the, the lovers, all right? But it's not just Adam and Eve. It's also Adam and Eve and that nasty-ass snake sitting in the middle of it. That snake represents toxicity. That snake represents temptation. Whatever that thing is, it's coming up in between this bond, okay? This is the reason why hangman is, me, is, hangman is here, okay? Because there is something that has come in between this that has caused somebody to be in a nine of swords. And what I have here, as far as the, the predator, the, 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 um, the, you know, the offender, you know what I'm saying? This dress is to impress, but my pockets don't fit the persona. So we got a fake and phony ass individual in the midst of this, okay? And this is the reason why all this stuff is happening. I got the devil twice on this board, y'all, okay? I just want y'all to know that this is in the main energy. So whoever this fake ass person is, okay, who dresses to impress and who like to be seen, who want to, uh, you know, laugh and smile and, and people face and shit and give recognition um, to whoever the hell else besides you, okay? That's where the problem is, all right? They want everybody else to like them except the motherfucker that got their back, okay? That's what it is. This person right here is in a four of points, okay? So, listen, I'm going to give you the signs in a minute. Um, this person is um, either having money problems, all right? Um, they're being uh, very secretive or they're just basically um, having a problem letting go or have let go, okay? One or the other, all right? My side note, you guys is uh let me see i got one two yeah there's three that uh, i ain't gonna count the devil so right now you know what i'm saying i only see two individuals however it's gonna be a third party because i, I got somebody walking in the opposite direction somebody got they you know it's, it's all about the money it's all about the socialization it's all about the being seen it's all about the networking okay this person is sexy strong courageous vivacious confident okay this person walks in all kind of different directions. In my opinion, there is a third party here. I ain't got that far because I haven't even clarified, but just the fact that I feel it, you know, nine times out of ten it is. 
listen, this person only thinks about money. This person loves money. This person goes after money. They think of all kind of ideas, good and bad, okay, to get it, okay? They they want to network, y'all. They, they like, you know, knowing this person. You know how them people is. You know this person. You know this person. You know this, yeah, it's that type of fuck shit, okay? It is, they want to be seen, all right? They, you know, this is about all who they know, okay? It's about who they know, um, you know what I'm saying, what they doing, all right? Don't they ain't worried about what they doing? They trying to come up, but what they trying to come up off is it's people who they know. You see what I'm saying? They 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 a fucking groupie is what it is. It's just that simple. I know you this person that somebody loves somebody here, okay? And if you the groupie, well then that's what the fuck it is. You keep on walking towards this damn money, and that's the only thing you damn care about. You being fake and phony with your dress to impress, okay? That means your pockets don't match your persona. So if this is you, that that's who I'm talking about. If this is somebody else or a cross watch or something, then I'm talking about that to you. Okay? So just like that. So anyway, we got um three energies in the main energy. Okay? We got the Ace of Wands. We got the Devil. And we got the Ace of Swords. Okay? Hold on one second. Because we got the Nine of Swords up here too. Yeah, so somebody seriously, this this energy of being blinded by the truth, this self-imposed prison, anxiety, fear, um, helpless, one word, no word, y'all, feeling trapped, powerless, victimized, or restrictions, that shit is times two, okay? Somebody got serious ass self-doubt, self-esteem issues, somebody done sat up here and told this person, whoever this is, that they ain't shit, okay, basically, okay? They have literally... Um, no matter how hard somebody try to do something, it still is not impressing this person. You need to understand, the only thing that impresses this person right here is if you got six, seven figures, okay? If you driving a certain kind of car, if your weave is eight, 40 inches, you know, this shit right here, this 30 inch shit ain't shit today, ass, okay? If 40 inches, driving nice cars, you know, jewelry, house, you know, all that shit, that's what they give a fuck about, and that's who they want to be seen with, okay? And if this ain't what you're doing, even though you on the come up, okay, listen, this person is going to tear somebody down, or vice versa, okay? Because they all about the money. It's just that simple. They're all about the money, y'all. And how they're seen. Feel me? They're all about the money and how they're seen. You see this? That's what direction they're walking in. Look to me like they done found the Leo Sagittarius Aries and who they're participating with, okay? At right now. You know, we got Leo Sagittarius Aries. We got uh, Sagittarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Capricorn on the board so far, and I haven't even clarified. So let's that that eight of uh, pentacles, excuse me, that eight of swords is in the last energy. Okay, listen, you got the king of swords cutting this shit out. Somebody energy is like, you know what? I'm not good enough for your ass. Well then, fuck you. Okay, that's what it feels like, or at least fuck you to a certain degree. First energy out is the ace of wands. This is sex, you guys. I could say that, all right, but it also means other things. Throw some words out at you. New beginnings, luck, accepting a challenge, birth announcement. Somebody could have just had a baby. Somebody could have heard somebody just had a baby. Somebody could have got somebody pregnant. Money, action, growth, inspiration, talent. Good news is coming. Inspiration. Listen, you got the devil, one or none of those words. You got the devil that is defining this. You got the devil in the second energy, too. So we got some toxicity going on here, okay? Um, this is the reason why somebody's in the nine of swords, and this is the reason why somebody is a hangman, because there is some type of toxicity going on. One of the toxic shit things is that you're dealing with a fake ass individual who is a wannabe. Somebody who is not who they say they are, they just aspire to be, okay? And they live in that way. They're overextending their credit. They're they're doing things that they ain't got no business doing because their money don't like match their pockets. And say that. It do say it right here. Okay. So I mean, you know, this is not just a person who got a nice car and they can afford their car. Okay. This is a person that got a nice car and they cannot afford their car. Okay. This is what this is. Okay. So anyway, with this Ace of Wands, y'all, the uh, devil is 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 clarifying that. That's restrictions. That's bondage. Okay. Temptations, manipulations, all types of addictions of every type of sort materialism this person is very materialistic with this devil in the middle y'all true to scorpio fashion all right we got the ten of cups okay so listen somebody in love with this motherfucker somebody in love with this toxic ass individual is just that simple However, somebody is getting to the point to where they're getting sick and tired of this shit. Somebody is in a nine of swords. I truly believe whoever you are, Scorpio, you find yourself in this. Y'all know, y'all know me well, okay? So y'all find yourself in this, okay? 
What it feels to me like is the person that's in the self imposed prison, the victim, the victimized individual is the one that's in this nine of swords, is the one that is tripping, is the one that is in despair, is in the one that is, you know, being left on red. They don't know what's going on. They don't know. Listen, this caused somebody to be in limbo. This caused somebody stagnation. The reason why is because their hands are tied. What, the, what is they going to do? You see what I'm saying? They can't make this person be who they want them to be. This person all over the goddamn place. The only thing they care about is money and sex and walking in whatever direction that is going to benefit them the most. But guess what? Play over here got money problems, okay? They they in the four so they in the four uh, pinnacles, okay? They don't want to let go. They don't want to let go of somebody, or they don't want to let go of their image, okay? They don't want to let go of the behavior that they've been displaying. They're very secretive as well. You see what I'm saying? This is all part of this toxicity. This is two devils from two different decks, y'all. Okay, is what I'm saying in your main energy. So anyway, you got the ten of cups. That is defining this, okay? This 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 person here, okay? That somebody loves. And then again, like I said, you got the Eight of Swords um, that is uh, blinded by the truth, self implosed helpless, fear, anxiety, powerless, restrictions, hands being tied. This could be a self imposed prison, y'all, as well. This could also be prison, jail, okay? Um, this could be abuse of some type of sort. Somebody could have jumped on somebody. Uh, King of Swords does not have a good attitude when he's running his, you know, in his uh, shadow side. So it could be that. Or it could be that, you know what, I'm tired of feeling like, I'm tired of allowing you to make me feel like this, okay? Helpless and powerless. I'm tired of you putting me in anxiety and shit. I don't know where the hell you are, and I'm tired of all the lies that you tell with these here swords, okay? Because swords can lie. It's thought. It's thinking. You see what I'm saying? Thinking of all this fuck shit to do. Get me up in this here nine of swords. Got me feeling like I'm going damn crazy because you toxic as hell, okay? It's for real, for real. You know, when I see the devil, y'all, I always say pick your own poison. Because, shit, I don't know these motherfuckers. You know these people, all right? So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and start clarifying this energy. Because it's some real messed up energy, Scorpio. I'm going to do y'all twice today. I'm going to do another video after this video. Because yesterday, for whatever reason, my videos was taking forever to upload. And um, I started to delete some of the videos. And I asked, I had y'all, I had y'all energy out. Um, but I deleted y'all video and so I already had Libra spread out So I said, let me just go ahead and do Libra and then I ended my readings for the day And I said, you know, that's real fucked up. I shouldn't have did Scorpio like that So what I'm gonna do is do y'all twice. So y'all have another video after this video. Okay um, Another thing too is, is you guys are make, making some changes. I'm not gonna make um, any changes in May I will be making the changes um, in June. Okay. Um, listen, the changes that I'm making are here to benefit you. I'm not taking away any free reads. I'm not doing anything like that. Okay. Um, but it will be some, some changes. Okay. But right now there are three different ways for you to get a free read. I announce my winners once a month and I actually announced one of my winners today. Speaking of, um, when I'm looking to verify y'all as a subscriber, it's very hard for me to do so when y'all, y'all about thing like y'all channels is blocked because that's what I do. I go to my subscribers channel and I look and see, I scroll down and see where I'm at. If I'm, if I'm there, then you're a verified subscriber. Now, if I call you, which I did, I called another person today to have her get back in contact with me because not only if, even if she's not the May winner, because I've, excuse me, the April winner, I've already checked up, um, pick my April winner. But even if she's not, I still will give a free read. And the reason why is because every hundred new subscribers, okay? So hopefully um, she gets that message. You guys comment below, okay? That is the best way for that you guys can win. The more you comment, the more you win. For every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read, okay? Um, I do do my monthly giveaways. The free reads are included in that. Um, and also because my channel is accepting donations at this point in the game, whoever donates to my channel for my lighting and all the stuff that I need, then um, somebody at that pool will be getting a free read as well. And, and donations are really appreciated. You guys, I really appreciate the ones that have supported the channel. Thank you so much. So with that being said, um, yeah, go ahead and comment below. It's, it's good to comment anyway, you guys. And the reason why it's good to comment, y'all, is because even if you guys do not get chosen to get a free read, a lot of times, I'm, I'm real hands-on with my subscribers, y'all. I get back all the time. A lot of times what I'll do is, is my subscribers will put some stuff down there, and what I'll do is I'll pick a card. You see what I'm saying? And I'll get back to you with what that card says. And sometimes I pick three cards. You see what I'm saying? So uh, comment, 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 because I love to hear from y'all. I really do. So, with that being said, thank you guys to uh, supporting me, riding with me. Um, if you guys have not subscribed to the channel, please accept my invitation to subscribe. Um, and, yeah, let's get it. Let's let's start. Um, 
let's start clarifying here. Cross watchers, you are more than welcome to sit and watch Scorpio. I do eight other signs, like me Tarot. You might find yourself over there, but if you want to watch Scorpio, I'm cool with that. I love cross watchers just as much. I get a lot of cross watchers that um that comment too, and I love my cross watchers just as much as I love my Scorpios. Okay, Holy Spirit, I'm already going through it. Just hundred dollars. All right, so let, let's see here. Let's let's go over here, okay? I see where money is on somebody's mind. Somebody may be promiscuous, you know. You're with this Queen of Wands and this Three of Wands and with this Ace of Pentacles, y'all. I mean, you know, that could be somebody out here, you know, getting money the best way they can, you know. Queen of Wands got a reputation of being very promiscuous, you know what I'm saying? With this Three of Wands, it could be to the point to where somebody actually be out here selling it, for real. Or they just got a whole lot of people who they dealing with, you know. It could be that. But we're gonna we gonna we're gonna skip over this for a second. We're gonna get back to that energy, all right? But I wanna know why, uh Holy Spirit, tell me why you have me pulling nine of swords for your sons, your daughters, and for your glory. Nine of swords. Somebody's working very hard to manifest somebody here, or somebody's working very hard to manipulate somebody here. Somebody may be in school, somebody may be starting their own business, okay? But somebody is working very hard to either manifest, trick, you know, um, or like I said, manipulate somebody in regarding this, okay? In regarding this nine of, nine of swords, you know, whoever's in this nine of swords could be like, how in the hell can I get somebody on the phone? How in the hell can I get somebody to talk to me? They want success in that or they already have had it, okay? But they're going to do all kinds of things. They're going to learn different ways to contact you. You need to understand this right here is manipulation though, okay? So don't believe everything somebody say, okay? When it comes down to if they get in contact with you about this here nine of swords, about this relieving, reliving past trauma. I need these lovers, please. Okay, we got the nine of swords again, okay? So listen, the reason why somebody is in limbo, some somebody needs to sacrifice something, somebody wants some more enlightenment, something to that degree, okay? When it comes down to the lover situation, the strong bond, this unity, these choices, listen, it's got somebody right back in the fucking nine of swords, okay? It's, it's like it's like I love you, but you, you know, I, I, I can't. I can't get through to you, okay? Somebody's feeling like that, okay? Somebody is full of fear. Somebody's full of anxiety. Negative thoughts are going through their mind. Like I said, somebody's not talking here. And if they are talking, it's not, you know, somebody at their breaking point. You know what I'm saying? You got an individual here who is, you know what I'm saying? I don't even know what the fuck you call them. You know what I'm saying? They flex. You know, they got their own. Like I said, they want everybody to see their ass except the person who they with. It's just that simple. They got money problems too. And they secretive as hell. Give me um, give me this dress to impress. Could be somebody husband, could be somebody um wife, okay, some type of higher connection. Yeah, some type of higher connection or something like that. We got Taurus on the board now, okay? Well twice, because four coins is Taurus too. But the higher fence is Taurus. So you could be married to this this fake ass person, okay? You could be. Um, or you know, it's a higher connection. Or it could be a spiritual connection, okay? Yeah, it could be a traditional sense of the word as far as like baby mama, baby daddy, you know, type situation, okay? Um, tell me more about this nine of swords and the overall energy. We got Cancer Pisces Scorpio. If it's not a Cancer Pisces Scorpio, we got love here. But somebody who was pulling back their energy, though, I can tell you that much. Yeah, they pull down their, they're pulling back their energy. Somebody here under this nine of swords, under this despair, this fear, this desperation, this negative thoughts, this being on red, this not returning somebody text or taking forever to return somebody text. Listen, somebody involved here is very slow to respond. They're very slow to um, progress. Um, they're very slow to, you know, even give somebody a damn truth for it, okay? It's almost like, 
If I mean something to you, why is it that I got to pull shit out of you? You see what I'm saying? Because they're not doing it on their own. And if they are, they're doing it very slowly. They breadcrumbing somebody is what's going on. Hold on, let me see these pinnacles because I got them now. Hold on. Okay, hold on. Okay, tell me more about this Nine of Swords and the main energy. I'm going to switch the text, y'all, because honestly. Here we go. Somebody is married here. Somebody a visionary. Somebody is ruthless, okay? Somebody ruthlessly did something to this person in the Nine of Swords. Got something to do with love. So they came off like they don't got no problem with spending no money. They came off like, you know, they a boss. You know what I'm saying? Listen, this person could have been married, y'all, okay? Could have been, and that's the reason why, because I got the king of wands to the queen of wands, okay? So listen, it could be a situation to whereas this 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 person right here goes back to their person, they go back and forth to y'all, okay? It could be that, okay? But this right here, they showing love, and that's what the problem is. They show it and they pull it back. Yeah, because this is the reason why. It's because you got the three of cups. It's a celebration. This is party, and this is get-together. It's third party, threesome, gossip. You know what I'm saying? This could be setups. For real, they could be plotting on some man body when it come down to this here love. Give me a second. Yeah, and this got somebody feeling real, 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 real fucked up. That's weird. Let's get into this main energy. What is this? Here we go with the three of wands again. So it's like they have sex, okay? They going back and forth. Uh, Y'all, they going back and forth between somebody, okay? Either you're married to this person, this fake and phony ass person, or this fake and, fair, fake and phony ass person is married to somebody else. Or they got a baby mama, baby daddy with this person. They keep going back and forth to them. It's just that simple, okay? That is the toxic toxic system. They lie and carry it on, you know. So they sit up here and make promises and carry it on, you know. Somebody has been very patient. Somebody been moving differently in this. Even though this behavior has been going on. Somebody wants this person. Okay, here we go. We got Queen of Cups here. This is, this can be you. Somebody's very emotional, okay, who's been being juggled or is juggling. Somebody has been getting mixed messages like a mug, okay? It's the reason because you somebody don't know a liar. That's why. It's the reason why the mixed messages, okay? Somebody's up and down and making decisions, all right? Give me the devil here. Yeah, somebody had to fall back. Even though they wanted this Ten of Cups, they had to fall back. They had to fall back. They had to retreat. This is third party. I don't have it, but four to swords, eight to swords, third party, okay? Yeah, somebody cutting this shit out. Somebody like, I'm not with this shit. Somebody knows that somebody is wasting somebody's time here. Somebody knows that somebody is not interested, or somebody knows somebody took somebody for granted, okay? They just ain't interested. This this 10 to this 3 is, is, is you know, hey. Give me more about this devil energy. Told you this person got a problem with giving. This is how they reel somebody in. There go you the world again, okay? Somebody wants this to turn out, okay? This is completion. This is achievement. This is wholeness. Lack of closure. Incomplete emotion, you know, emptiness. One or all of those words. We got Virgo towards Capricorn popping up on the scene. What are they doing? Giving love, okay? Happiness, fulfillment, stability, security, love. Okay, somebody see their future in somebody's eyes here, okay? Underneath this devil card. Underneath this toxicity, somebody knew they had to retreat. Somebody fell back. It could have been a toxic person that fell back, okay? 
or it could have been whoever, okay? But nonetheless, somebody gave to this connection. Somebody's very kind. Somebody's very charitable. And I think the reason why is because, damn, y'all, somebody gave to this connection so that this will of fortune to spend. So it's almost like if I do for you, if I give to you, you know, maybe you may see me and we can't got dang on get to this happiness because you got 10 of cups and you got, you, you got two 10 of cups here. Okay, this is love beyond love, and this is the reason why somebody is giving something to somebody. It could be sex, it could be money, it could be material items, it could be whatever. Whatever. Okay, this is the god dang on six of god dang on um, pinnacles. Okay, so I mean, you know, it could be whatever somebody is giving to, but what it feels like is somebody is bribing somebody. Okay, like I want you to see me, so I'm gonna give into this relationship. You know, that type of shit. Okay, which is not healthy for real, for real. Somebody sees somebody is stable here. Somebody sees somebody is somebody who could be good at home and take care of home and carrying on. But you got to understand, this is a toxic ass individual. This is coming up underneath the devil. All right. Ain't don't nothing good come from the devil, y'all. I'm just saying, y'all do know that. Ain't nothing good come from this. Even though I see love here, but this is, this is, you got the devil twice. You know what I'm saying? It ain't even like this motherfucker part show uh, toxic. This motherfucker toxic through and through. They lie. They, you know, gaslight. They going back and forth to somebody with these three of wands, and you got three of wands twice, okay? That is taking the action in, in a direction. What it looked like is taking action is in the direction of this here Leo Sagittarius Aries. Hold on, where the other three of wands at? Sagittarius they could be walking towards. Leo Sagittarius Aries or uh, juggling uh, Cancer Pisces Scorpio. All right. And having good sex with Cancer Pisces Scorpio. All right. Capricorn could be relevant here. All right. So uh, let's see here. Let's see these cups here. Somebody got too many options, y'all. Way too many options. They don't know which one to choose. And as a matter of fact, with this here energy, they like having all these goddamn options. They make them feel a certain type of way. I told you it's a fake and phony, okay? So, you know, by people validating them, by people wanting them and shit, it make, they, they, hit, they get the big head, okay? Is what happens. Somebody married to this person. They got the higher connection, baby mama, baby daddy, something, okay? Okay, hold on. Yeah, somebody want to return on their damn investment, too. Give me um this lover's card up here by this hangman. Somebody want to plant seeds for a better and brighter future. I told you somebody is somebody is really paying somebody, you know, to be with somebody here. They willing to do it quick. They want to plant seeds for a better and brighter future to God dang get to them quick. Okay, this could be you. This could be a cross watcher. Somebody may be pregnant here. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn is on the board. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Is on the board very, very heavy, okay? You got air, you got earth, and you got fire on this board very heavy. Um, give me the key, give me the um eight of swords, Holy Spirit, please. Here we go. Cutting off this lovers, okay? So all this blinded by the truth, blinded to the truth, self imposed prison, anxiety, fear, helplessness, powerlessness, feeling trapped. All that old bullshit. Somebody in the King of Swords energy, they cutting off this lover's card, okay? Y'all got lovers twice. This is a serious-ass divine connection. This is a serious-ass bond. Somebody is messing this up. Give me the inference. Somebody pregnant here, okay? Somebody got somebody pregnant. Somebody pregnant. Somebody happy to be pregnant. Somebody happy to have somebody child. Give me more, Holy Spirit. We got Leo on the board. Virgo towards Capricorn. And it is the by this person. So, look. if Let's just say, Scorpio, that you messing with somebody, right? And they're going back and forth, okay, to whoever. They got money on their mind. They fake and phony. You know they fake and phony, okay? Ain't no way in hell you don't know this person fake and phony on some type of level. Scorpio, you do. So let's just say that you know this, right? Well, what's happening is, is they're going back and forth to their baby mama or baby daddy, okay? They, they, you got the empress here. Virgo towards Capricorn. These is puzzle pieces, you guys. I'm going to read it how I read it. You guys, you, sometimes one piece one piece is missing you know what i'm saying so puzzle pieces y'all okay 
But what it looks like here is, is that whoever this individual that keep on going back and forth to, whoever, this person may got money, okay? Or this person may help with the business with your person. Let's just say your person is the fake and phony one, right? Okay, well, they keep going back and forth to this person because this person got money. They're sexy. They're strong. They're vivacious. They cool. They got an attitude problem, okay? But they keep walking in that direction. They're not willing to let them go. What's showing up now is is that this person could be pregnant. Now, this could be you or this could be the third party, okay? But this this motherfucker over here pops off a lot, all right? This person right here got a mouth on them, okay? And like I said, they into groups. They got a lot of family. They got a lot of friends. You know, they're very sociable. You see what I'm saying? And they're very vengeful, okay? This is a Leo Sagittarius Aries somewhere in their chart. Could be you, could be you, Scorpio, that got a Leo Sagittarius somewhere in the chart. But you know what? The same, whoever this individual is, the same individual, okay, got a baby by this person or is pregnant by this person or you got them pregnant or there's a baby somewhere up and around this person. Tell me, tell, tell me more about the Queen of Wands over here in this energy because this right here, it feels to me, happy Sagittarius, somebody is single and abundant, nine of pentacles, give me more. Yeah, see, ho. Oh. All right, it is a hoe, just like I said. Okay, yeah. So let's see here. We got the nine of pentacles. Yeah, to this two of pentacles. So listen, somebody is very confused. Somebody's being sent a lot of mixed messages. Look like this Cancer Pisces Scorpio. This Queen of Cups is the one that's very confused. Okay, they're making decisions. They're up and down emotions. Wishy-washy juggling, being juggled and shit, but actually loves having sex with this person, actually wants a new beginning. Listen, y'all could have found out because Ace of, Ace of, so Ace of um, uh, Wands, y'all, I mean, you know, that's birth announcements. Somebody could have found that shit out, okay, that somebody pregnant, somebody got pregnant or something like that. Mm-hmm. Trying to see, hold on. Yeah, beefing is already taking place. Give me um, give me this, give me this um, eight of swords. Yeah, like I said, beefing is already taking place. Okay, somebody wounded, set back, guarded. Somebody might be in jail, um, hospital, perhaps. Somebody might have got jumped. Okay, with this three of cups. Um, nonetheless, wounded, set back, and guarded. Yeah, and it's all because of this page of wands energy. Somebody gonna be getting some information. You got somebody buck wild out here. Somebody full of adventure, ambitious, high energy, active, free spirit, and do what the fuck they want to do, period. They fake and phony. Somebody is. I don't know who it is, but it's somebody here that's fake and phony. Okay, let me see these wands here. Somebody thought about this. Somebody's thinking about this. Somebody's in thought mode. Somebody is, um, you know, thinking about building some type of boundaries, falling back from this person. Uh, Holy Spirit, tell me about this fake person. Somebody married here, okay? Baby mama, baby daddy. Somebody went inside. Virgo was here now. Somebody thought about this. Introspect. Oh, God dang. Yeah, ending is going to change. Travel may have something to do with this. Possibilities, completions. Uh, freedom, wholeness, end of cycle, closure. Somebody might have graduated here. We got the world, y'all. Person may got dang on travel to do what they need to do. We got the ten of swords now, okay? Up underneath this fake ass, phony ass person who got dang secretive and got money problems coming up underneath marriage, which is the higher thing. Got dang on baby mama, baby daddy somewhere, okay? Um, somebody went inside. Somebody wants to end the cycle, okay? And when they ended the cycle or a cycle began, here we go with this ten of swords. This is betrayal. This is backstab. This is left for dead, all right? This is the reason why somebody's in the nine of swords. This is a prelude. Somebody knew this shit was happening, okay? Every time I see this, it always reminds me of, like, when you can see the future. You see what I'm saying? When it lines up like this. It's almost like somebody was in the nine of swords feeling something, knowing something, but did not necessarily have a proof. And they literally seen it unfold. This is how this shit is happening, okay? Somebody knew about the party and the get-together, and all this type of stuff. Just like I said, this could be setups. This could be somebody got jumped. But nonetheless, somebody is betrayed. Double betrayed, actually. Yeah. 
Because to that 9, to that 10, this is not your average betrayal. This is some serious ass betrayal right here. It's not your average. Hold on. Let me see this on me. Yeah, somebody was real fucked up. Real fucked up. Really wanted to talk to somebody, but could not talk to somebody. Somebody had their friends and family looking at this. Somebody might have got jumped here. Somebody got into it with friends and family of some type of sort. Some words was exchanged. Give me this eight of um. Somebody wounded, set back, party. Like I said, a hospital is here, victimized. Jail is here. Somebody might have put their hands on somebody here. But listen, somebody's not interested. So either the person that's victim, victimized... Um, who got jumped on is no longer interested or the person who was victimized um, that's full of anxiety, feeling trapped and, you know, helpless and stuff and powerless, either found out that this lovers right here you know, really set them back, y'all they set them back it wounded them, it hurt them, this shit killed somebody on the inside, okay because somebody buck wild out here and they came to the conclusion that this person just really just is not interested, okay Holy Spirit, tell me about this um this first energy with this ace of um yeah see all sex didn't I tell you they walk back and forth it's money and sex y'all that's all they give a fuck about give me more somebody could have had a baby here yeah and they talk a lot they talk a lot and they want to talk to both you and them all right see and there go your not five of wands there go your beefing and shit okay and there you, you go because of these secrets reason why it was all this beefing and shit is because something came to the damn light okay somebody talking to two damn people pretty much telling them the same shit somebody got a baby somebody don't okay we got conflict we got confusion we got beefing we got fighting and y'all throwing hands somebody is either them and the third party or you and them or you done jumped on them, one the other, fighting, you know, being jumped. Like I said, it feels like somebody been jumped here, too. Or somebody's plotting to get jumped, set up, miss, you know, just a whole bunch of messy ass shit. This could even be shootouts, y'all. I mean, I don't put nothing past five miles for real. You know what I'm saying? But somebody definitely is building boundaries here. Let me see if I can see anything else here. I don't see many pinnacles. Yeah, somebody wanted a family with this person. Somebody see their future in their eyes and somebody wanted a family. Love and stability. That is what they wanted. That was the goal. But this shit got shut down with Queen, Queen of King of Swords. Tell me more about King of Swords, Holy Spirit. Yeah, see, somebody was confused. Didn't I tell you somebody was actually confused? Somebody was super confused, y'all. Super confused. Had a ser serious, difficult decision to make. Give me this Ten of Swords. Today I'm going. Somebody walked away. Somebody left. Okay. Somebody left in this situation. Somebody loved somebody hellified. Okay. Hellified. But who somebody loved was a fake. This is a. You know what I'm saying? Let me get a little mug shot. This is a fake phony bitch right here. Okay. They sit up here and they say all the shit that somebody want to hear. They want to be and they ain't got. They in the four of uh, uh, coins, okay? They may come off like they got it, but they really just don't, okay? So, you know, you can't always judge a book by its damn cover, okay? And just because they able to pull out some money here and there don't mean that that shit is long-lasting ass money like how this motherfucker wanted to seem like, okay? It's almost like, look at me, okay? And then another thing, too, is, is, you know, they really not interested in, you know, knowing anybody who really ain't about it, okay? But they have caused a lot of confusion, all right? They really have. They've caused a lot of confusion. They caught a lot of beefing, okay? And they have hurt somebody beyond hurt. They have abandoned somebody. Somebody walked away here. Somebody left because they thought that the grass was greener on the other side. Or somebody just stopped fighting for the relationship. Bottom line is, Scorpio, is that this person is a hoe, okay? And they never been interested. they never been interested in what you would call... A traditional sense of the word a relationship okay what they're interested in is coming up what they're interested in is getting their cake and eating it too that's what they're interested in and you can best believe that's what the fuck they're doing they're very toxic the devil done came up uh, here twice somebody has shown emotions but look here just because somebody has showed emotions and somebody to move differently that is not changing them okay it's just not I hate to say it but it's the truth it's a damn shame actually 
But um, you know, hey, yeah, you got uh, you know, let me see who you got here. Sagittarius, Taurus. I truly believe third party or you got either um, um, what the fuck, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius in your chart or as the third party. Okay. I see Cancer Pisces Scorpio down here wanting a new beginning. I see some Cancer Pisces Scorpio with the Queen of Cups here uh, being sent mixed, mixed messages. Okay, it does not have to be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio, but it damn sure does mean whoever loved somebody. Okay, because this is the Queen of Cups. This is somebody who loves somebody for real, for real. Okay, they have exercise patience. They are moving differently. They are plagued by different thoughts and having to make a decision. Um, they are, um, being told, uh, mixed messages. Somebody is very wishy-washy with this here toxic ass behavior. The only thing somebody wanted was a 10 of cups. That's everything. I just, I just love you and I just want to be with you. That's, that's really just it. You know what I'm saying? They could have been married to them because I do got the heart in here. Okay. But I also got three of cups. Okay. This is sell of a cook for the funeral, but I don't think so. Could have been, might have been, could have possibly. Okay. But nonetheless, celebration. I'm sorry, y'all. I had a phone call coming in. Celebration, party, get together, third parties, threesome, gossip, and messiness. And guess what? Also, with this five of wands, that could also mean being jumped, okay? Because you do got um jail, hospital here, setback, wounded, and guarded, okay? So that could be the situation, Scorpio. But um, this is what I got for you. If you guys stay to the end of the video, let me know that y'all stay to the end of the video because you know what I said to um to the ones I did last time. I said I think I'm gonna start playing favoritism to the ones who stay to the end of the video. So y'all, if y'all watch this to the end of the video, y'all put down there that y'all watch to the end of the video. Now don't go telling folks, okay? Because then everybody gonna watch to the end of the video, which is good. That which is good because I'm gonna you know I think I'm gonna start playing playing favoritism as far as my giveaways for people who actually sit and watch the whole video, okay? So with that being said, I love you guys dearly. I hope I was able to put at least one piece together, okay? Because it's not going to resonate on the whole level for, for you guys, all of you. You know, some of you guys, it will. Um, but if it's just one piece that you ain't got, and I was able to give you that one piece, then I did my job. And for that, I love you guys. And um, I'll see you guys soon. I'm going to do another video for y'all. I'll see you soon, Cap. I mean, um, see somebody below the Capricorn, okay? That's off the top, because I know I'm doing Scorpio. I know I'm doing it twice. Somebody is fucking with a Capricorn. Whoever fucking with that Capricorn is doing this shit, put it down in the comments. But other than that, I will see you guys um, in just one second, Scorpio, with another video. I love you guys dearly. I love you. Okay?